Hello. Use the Schmittis and in two files, a very big one and a small one, and they're both on the SD card for testing. Actually, on both devices, it took quite a while to upload it to the M92, so I used an external card reader for that. Now let's have a first look at the files. Let's start with the small one. Okay. Here on the left side, I see that basically this bit is kind of missing, so you have to scroll while here it is zoomed so that the whole page fits. And so that's the third page. Um, I would say that both are quite readable the way they are. Maybe you can try to see it here. I will take a picture later on with the camera, but to me that looks okay. Now, the more interesting bit. The large file. Let's see how fast that opens. It's 400 megabytes big. Here I get a warning, which might mean something, lo so let's start here on the M92. Okay, I used a pen. To me this looks all quite readable, but there was also the request to use the, the zoom mode. So probably let's say from there to maybe around here. And I would say this really looks quite nice. Okay, here we are obviously off page. Let's see if the automatic height margin does something for us. No, it doesn't. So one would need to fiddle a bit around there. Then the request was to go, I think, to page 27. Okay, now that we're closer. Yes, and I think that was about the Greek footnotes. I used the zoom mode. So this is what it looks like. Now, to my eye, it looks readable, even though I can't read it. I will refresh the screen to make sure that we have the proper rendering. So this is the size and I guess this just begs um, for a picture with the camera as well. In the meantime, the pocketbook has the text as well. 
I will go to page 27 there as well. Oops, that was one too fast. You always get a preview in the background, which is kind of nice. This I would say is probably quite hard to read on that zoom level. Let's zoom in a bit. Okay. And here again one needs to scroll, which might be a bit of a pain when reading. This is mostly an issue with the Adobe Reader. What I'll do is I'll exit this one and choose to open the file with another program, the PDF viewer. Usually that actually renders the page much lighter, so it's not a question of the th of the screen itself. I think it's a more software issue. It will probably take another while as well, but just let's have a look. In there um, the adjustment of the zoom selection in regards to the overall screen size usually is much better. Okay, this is a bit of waiting time. And uh, more waiting time. And here we are. I think that was bearable. Not as fast, obviously, as on the M92, but still usable. It's still doing something, so. Okay, we have the preview, and it's still doing something, as you can see. Well, you can't see on the light, and now it's off. Doesn't matter. Let's zoom in here. Okay, probably a hundred and twenty percent. Here we go. And then usually I found that after switching pages you have as you we have here um the zoom selection fitted right into the screen. And that's what it looks like. Really blurry, isn't it? So I think that's a, it for now for the video and I'll take the two promised pictures starting with this one. Thanks a lot.